Hey you guys, Bryce off here, and welcome to the land of monsters. We gotta get back on the float spell brigade. I never did fill up, did I? Oh well, it'll be fine. I'm not worried. I'm worried. Let's ask for help, because monsters always help. And you notice how you can see through the next floor? This is a recurring theme in this area. It's kind of neat. Neat effect, I guess, for early SNES era stuff, you know? Warriors and Fiends, a pretty common grouping if I recall. Maybe not, we'll find out. Hey, you leave Rosa alone. What'd she ever do to you, man? Uh, so far they seem to be just physical hitters, my type of boys. Especially since that means they aren't doing anything too mean to me. Which we can all get behind. Alright, so a few physical whacks and they go disappearing down a pipe dream hole. What do you got? That's what you got, huh? No! That's bad. You cut that crap out. Hey, whoa, you leave poor Edge alone. He's got enough problems. He doesn't need you piling on. That is for sure. Thank you for fixing Kane for me. You did it, guys. You fixed him up and made him humble and... I gave him the sex bud, and she's out of arrows. All right, so I gotta switch her arrows right after this fight. I she, he says. More virus for your life, you little jerk faces. But we've seen what they got. We've seen what they got. They got's the charm. I just gonna punch himself in the face. You can feel that one coming. No, actually, he's going after our fearless leader. What a jackass. Edge gains a level after beating the shit out of everyone in the. Team, way to go, Edge, you jerk. We took all of Cecil's healing, but we got there, guys. We got there. And finding these hidden passages takes a little bit more work here. They're not as blatantly obvious as they have been, but you can still see them pretty easily. It is trippy to look at that effect on the ground, I tell ya. I t oh, I don't think so. I left Edge muted because he doesn't have a whole lot of magic points left, and I'm not going to use his magic that often anyway. I think Radia or Rosa or both are going to go down here because them in the front row is bad news bears for them, let me tell you. Alright, so get attacked after two steps. That, that, that's great. Could you guys leave me alone for half a second? Jesus. Man, they're going out of their way to beat my ass. Those guys are mean. But I can live with it and I can take it because we're moving onwards into the next chunk of the cave. Hopefully, it'll be a little nicer than what we just fought our way through, because ye gods, that took a while. Just to deal with the pure malarkey of it all. You might say, that didn't seem like such malarkey. Hey, it's a hooligan. You ready for some soccer? Hee <laughs> hee! Soccer hooligan? Soccer hooligan? You juros get the joke, don't you? It's not really a joke, more just a straight, wow. He didn't let me finish my preamble, because my ramble was an amble and an angle of the dangle, and... He seems to be a little out of place considering those other guys who have been making my life a miserable little existence, uh, realm. Could be some monsters here. No, it's just a straight up cabin. Alright, alright, take it. We'll take it. I will not take that though. So, oh, I will take that sitting down. You know what? I just don't want to fight them. <laughs> they take too long to kill and they've been murdering my ass in the next week. Alright, let's check down here. Let me guess, my friends again? Of course it is. And now they're trying to come at me from behind. Gross. Oh, man. Poor Cecil. Poor Rosa. Animus. Fantastic. Yeah, it looks like running might be the better part of Valor when it comes to those jack and innies. That is for sure. All right. How about over here? No, we will not find out just now. Because first, the oh, the conjurer. Or conjurer. I'm not really sure how to say that. Okay, this is an easy call. The Rock Moth is no big deal. He, I mean, it's a deal, but it's not that big a deal. Could one of you maybe go? Just pretend you're caring? You want to kill off the one they can summon first, but it's... Hey, you stop getting her addicted to coke, okay? That is not what you're here for. Might as well face it, you're addicted to love. That's what I hear, anyway. Cast some virus. Dead as hail. And I think this... I don't know. We'll see if this thing's weak to arrows if it survives. 
But it didn't. Yeah, that's an easy one. They called more dangerous stuff than that further into the cave, I believe. Alright, so she's Cool Man Shades McGee. We can't have that, can we? No, we cannot. Alright, how are we doing on the, 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 the life? Not so great. Not so good, Al. Hmm. Well, then, let's just do that and do that. These are the things we can do, guys. It's a cure, too. All that work for an even cure, too. Uneven believable. No, I don't think so. We're out of here. We're out of here. Summon your moth. That's the dangerous stuff I was thinking of. The clapper. The clamps! Oh god, it's putting me in the clamps. Except it's the claps, but still, I don't care. I'm getting the hell out of Dodge. It's weird how it can summon different different stuff on the same floor. I assumed it would be the same on... Again, what are you going to summon, I guess? I guess we'll find out. Yeah, we can deal with Motharoos. Motharoos ain't no big a deal -a I can tell you that right... Hey, cut that out. We'll gladly virus everyone in next week. Excellent. Shablam! There we go. Gone. Not gone. Wow. Color me surprised. Now gone. Okay. Color me less surprised. Good. I'm glad that missed, because that would have been annoying to go heal. Alright. 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 So what am I going to do here? I... Um, everyone says everything's fine. Everything's fine. Hit points are down a bit on Cecil. Big friggin' deal. We are gonna just make our way in the world today. I know it's taking everything we've got to do that, but that's okay. We can get this done. We can do this. We can move onwards. I'm seeing some boards down below and chests that, that that's potentially ominous. You again? Really? That's how we're gonna do this? What are you calling in? What the hell is that? That is horrifying. You get that shaz out of here. Thankfully, I've got float on. Otherwise, that would murder my ass. Another good reason to come through with float on. Let me tell you what. Shablam. Not that type of shablam. Bye bye. <laughs> You dead. And you're also, oh man, you ain't feeling good. You ain't feeling good at all. That also makes me feel bad for you, because that's not going to do you any good. Bye bye. Excellent. Alright. Cecil gains a level. Not, the spirits isn't as good in here as it is in the other cave. That's kind of shocking. I guess they expect you to come here first, then, theoretically, hypothetically, if I had to imagine it. Just imagine all the people, guys. Just imagine. Alright, what's one thing I could do? Well, one thing I did was I gave Rosa some arrows while she was, you know, in the middle of a fight, but I can give her the rest of the mute arrows I bought for her so that she can take care of the biz. Nasty. Alright, we got that. Good. And we got that. Good. Not that Cure 3 potions are ever going to come in that handy. Really, they're not. I probably will never use them. Just like elixirs. It'll probably never happen. That's a shame. Cure 2. Uh-huh. Poison Axe. And a Ninja Sword. Ooh. Well, we can get rid of that middle sword that I'm theorizing. Oh, very nice. Beautiful. I took the boomerang off him because it just strikes me as weird. I don't like it. So that's just a way back over to here. Okay. Neat. Nah, I'm not doing the from behind crap. That's not how we do. Flapper again? No, it's the Arachne. Just, just run. Oh. Hee! I like how Edge was still on the ground. Wasn't showing his float. Thankfully, it still applied for him, because that quake would have booted his face in. So we're going to wander back over here, and we're going to go up this time in the little hidden passageway and see what's awaiting us here. Why, well, it seems pretty simple so far. Oh, is there one near the... Oh, good, there's one right there. That's even better. So we didn't have to go the long way home. We did, but we didn't have to, guys. That's that's the take-home message. We'll let Quake McQuake Zax here have her fun. She seems to love just going straight to the Quake the Quake Mobile. She loves running Quake. She's on old speed demo archive. She's having a good time. 
Not dead yet, but you're going to be dead, don't you worry. You're going to feel it. That's enough to get rid of her. So if you run into something like that has the rock moths, you could theoretically let her just summon rock moths all day long, because you can kill them quickly. It's the theory I would operate under, and you'd have a good time. Seems like an operable, optimal, operational, optimist prime of a certain thing to assume, and this has got to be monsters. Oh yeah, there's no way we're getting through this whole cave without that. Five warriors, yikes, I maybe should have healed. Maybe I should have healed. Alright, Roddy gains a level, as does Rosa, and Cure 4 is in the bag. Noice. We get the defense sword. Now that might cast something in battle, perhaps. Is it better than the light sword, is the question. Indeed it is. It just ups our defense. Okay, well that's kind of cool. That's kind of cool. But I don't care so much to fight four fiends to really show it off. Alright, moving back here, we'll get into this teleport and see where it takes us. If we can ever get there, game, please. Please. Uh, how what's so surprising about a conjurer? Conjurer? I don't know. Just don't call me late for dinner. Ha <laughs> ha! Terrible. Alright, so let's head inside here and see what's up. Hey, you. Rydia, you came back, so this must be the place. Well, we're gonna steal their treasures and enjoy doing it because we are the bastards of rat variety. 3,000 gold pieces. Our king. Your king resides deep in the... Oh, this guy doesn't seem in such a hurry. Oh, neat. 2,000 gold. Don't mind if I do. So you can kind of see everything kind of going on. It's kind of cool, guys. It's kind of really cool. Well, that's kind of neat. But she's a caller, so... Could you get out of the way? Thank you. Oh, well, I had to make sure I got my 2,000 gold pieces. You know, my Reese's pieces, as it were. And to get to that spot down here, you just gotta go over here and get over the and get yourself a rat tail. That will be very important soon enough. But not yet. Just like the Yang quest, we can't do everything right now. Is it strange? Yeah, a little bit. I'm not gonna lie, it's a little strange. Now, what do you guys got here? The usual? Okay, and what do you got? You're the inn. Nah, I'm good. I will at some point. See what you guys got going on here. <laughs> that's true. Well, that's kind of neat. Burning as usual, because he's fire. You see that? But it's a joke, seriously. Somehow, some way, they count that as a joke. What do we got here? Anything? Oh, that's a bomb. Hey, bomb. Glad to see you back. Just don't blow your top. <laughs> hey, you. Don't go again. Sorry, we gotta save the world there, jackass, so try, stop telling me what to do. We got that, we got that. Beautiful, beautiful. How about you? You're the same bomb. Get out of my face. Let's go talk to the red bomb over here. Yes, don't blow us up. Don't do it, okay? Just don't do it. I could study a bit, but that's a lot of work. It's a lot of work. Be quiet. No, I'm good. This is a great book, yeah? Is it the new Stephen King? Don't read the ending, it's probably going to be terrible. Never find it boring. Eh, that's kind of true. Yes, we do. It's mostly pornography, though. Would you get out of the way? Get. There you go. This takes us into here. Hey, you. Room for the king and queen. Hey, you. The king, not me. All right. Please help us. First to see your worthiness. Uh, not yet, because I'm not healed up. You actually have to fight the queen and then the fellow with her. you got to fight both of them. And if you beat them, you can summon each one after you beat them. Because they're monsters, like everyone else down here. So you can get, you can get some decent summons. Yeah. Yeah. So, let's just go in here and talk to this guy in here. So we can get a blitz whip for her, absolutely. And we can get charm arrows, I suppose, but it's not really of my interest. Now, the blitz whip, I'm trying to remember what its special ability is. I don't know, all I know is that that's basically her best weapon, so, you know. She'll be depending on her magic. I mean, for someone like me who doesn't like using magic, and I pump magic like mad in this game, it's because A, magic is powerful, and B, you really gotta depend on it. 
Oh no, your friends are definitely not behaving themselves and I'm gonna have to teach them a lesson in goddamn respect. Queen name Asura. Asura? Asura? I always thought it was Asura. Doesn't mean that's what it is. Well, tough shit. Uh-huh. Well, don't ha talk smack then. Age of shield and a sorcerer robe. Well, let's buy one and buy one. Let's see what we got. Take that. F it's been a while since we've upgraded shields and such. Yeah, that's that's something. It's nothing great. I think the Aegis Shield might have some kind of special ability to it. But I don't remember what it does, guys. Do I look like I know anything? Hell to the no, Batman. Oh, that is, that's beautiful. So we gotta buy... One more, and one more. Actually, technically, even Cecil could wear it if he wanted to. Uh, I wanted Cecil, thank you. Alright. No, that's not what I want. Well, first of all, let's get rid of his crappy silver shield. Yeah, that's something. Except that I want to test him for the sorcerer one to see if it does him any good. I doubt it does. But you never know. Now, well, if I ever wanted him to have better... better magic, I suppose it'd be something. But I don't use much magic with him, so why would I waste my time? The answer is... I wouldn't. Alright, so we're feeling pretty good. I'm just going to quickly sell off some junk. Alright, we burned down some significant money, but that's how it goes sometimes in the land here. The land that they call the muck. So, you might be saying, I saw some chests. Yeah, right down there. How do we get to those? Well, to get to those, we are going to have to look. Maybe you saw the tile earlier and we're like, Brian, you're missing it! Especially those that have played. Don't you worry. I was not planning on missing it, because this is also the easy way out of this place. You go here yeah, to the hidden one, and you walk up to here, yeah, and you get to enjoy these. A samurai, an elixir, an ether 2, and a samurai bow. So you get 10 samurai arrows, which are crazy powerful, but you don't get access to more of them, I don't think, for a while. Like Shablam, that's a good, that's a pretty good bow for her. So that elven bow didn't get much use, but it'll get some, and if you want to get out of here, Here's the way to go, right here, and it gets you out. So, that'll do it for now for the Land of Summon Monsters. I am going to go deal with, uh, or do I want to go back to the Land of Summon Monsters? No, I feel pretty good about what we've accomplished. We've shown off a couple other things. We've gained a little bit extra equipment to make life a little more fun. And we can even uh, do that other thing, you know that thing? I mean, there's one valid reason to try to take on Ashura Leviathan, who's the other guy. You get some pretty good spells. However, that is not in the House of Wheels that I'm looking to do. Not even round the wheels could dissuade me from my course. No, we are back into the seal cave. See you guys next time. Back fighting trapdoors and going to get that last dark crystal. King Gaia must be wondering what the hell we're doing.